Hey guys, welcome to today's integral training workout. We're gonna be using the 20 second high, 10 second rest protocol, 16 minutes of high intensity interval training, two minute warm up, two minute cool down. Let's get right into the warm up. If this warm up doesn't excite you, grab a skipping rope, skip it out for two minutes, jog on the spot, do jumping jacks. Otherwise, let's get going. Arms and legs in a little march. Get that body warmed up, get the heart rate up, get it pumping oxygen around to these working muscles, bring it into a knee to elbow. So I'm gonna be using five pound weights today. You can use higher or lower weights or keep the weights out, it's up to you, go at your own pace. I'm also gonna show you lower impact as well as lower intensity options. So you're here to have a good time, you don't wanna be killing yourself, bring it into a low lunge. During the high intensity intervals, you only need to keep your heart rate at 80 to 90% of your max. You do not need to go all out. Plenty of studies show the effectiveness of interval training at 80 to 90% of the max. I've got links in a lot of my YouTube videos to show that for the naysayers out there. <laughs> Give me three, two, one, breathe in. Breathe out, walk those hands forward. Push back into downward facing dog. Bring it forward again. Walk those hands back up. Breathe in and out. We'll jog on the spot. So in the first round today, we're gonna to do two lots of burpees. I promise you that's the only burpees we're doing for all of the intervals today. It's gonna be jumping jacks. And you can go at your own pace, guys. You do not need to do the burpee with the a jump back, you can step back. Same with these jumping jacks. Step side to side. There's no need to jump around if that's not for you. All right, guys, we've got five seconds. Get into position for burpees. Here we go. So optional push up, optional jump in the air, or step back, step forward, or you can jump back and jump forward, leaving out the push up and leaving out the jump. We've only got five seconds to go. Okay, next we're gonna do skater hop. Just rest and watch. Low intensity option, higher intensity. Here we go, skater hop. So if you wanna go higher intensity, you hop it right over. Otherwise, just gently step. Go at your own pace. Five more seconds. Really reach that hand down to the floor. Shake it out. Here comes our second burpee. It's the only other one we're doing today. In three, two, here we go. Only 20 seconds. So the option, step back, step forward, jump back, jump forward, jump back with the push up with an optional jump. Give me one more. All right, here we go. Skater hops again. In three, two, one. So you can take it slow, nice and slow, or really jump it. Jump from one leg to another. If you're doing the higher intensity option and really reach down. With five more seconds, three, two, one. Guys, come down onto the floor. We're doing a push up to push back on your knees or on your toes. So if you're on your toes or knees, you do a push up and push back. Push up, push back. So on your knees, and you're pushing up and you're pushing back. If you don't like this, just stick with the push up. Give me two more. No, I lied. That was the last one. <laughs> All right, guys, we're gonna repeat that. So when you're pushing back, you're pushing back onto your toes and getting your knees off the ground. So I'll show you. Push up and push back. Doing it on my knees and pushing back onto my toes and coming off my knees in the push back. Come on guys, a few more. Otherwise, 
Just stick with push-ups. One more. Well done, guys. Come on to your hands in a plank. We're gonna do a straight leg cross under. Here we go. It's a straight leg under. If you don't like this, either just hold plank or move your knee in a diagonal under you. Otherwise, straight leg. You can tap it out if you need to. We'll try and keep it off the ground. One more. All right, guys, we're gonna do that one more time. I saw this move called break dancer. I don't know if I look like a break dancer, but here we go. Kicking the leg out to each side. Just keep with the knee cross under or a static plank. Only got 10 seconds to go. You can tap your foot if you need to. Otherwise, try and keep it off the ground. Three, two, one. Woo! One down. All right, guys. Next exercise. Pick up your hand weights if you're using them. We're gonna do side lunge to the right. Step together, left kick. Here we go. Side lunge to the right, left kick. Side lunge to the right, left kick. I'm doing a bicep curl as I lunge to the right. Side lunge to the right, left kick. Give me one more, left kick. Woo. Shake it out. Next up, side lunge to the left, kick right. In three, two, one, here we go. Side lunge to the left, right kick. So you're lunging, bringing your feet together and kicking. And oops, give me a bicep curl on the lunge to the left. Let's go guys. That's it, shake it out. We're gonna repeat on the right. One more each leg. Three, two, one. Side lunge to the right, kick left. Side lunge to the right, kick left. Give me a nice deep lunge. All that body weight over that right leg and coming back up before you go into that kick. Give me one more. You can leave the hand weights out. It's a tough enough exercise without them. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Side lunge left, kick right. And go at your own pace. If you really need to slow it down a lot more, slow it down. Doesn't matter how many you do. What matters is good form. Let's go. Come on guys, squeeze out one more. Ah, there we go. All right guys. Now we're gonna do squat, lean to the side, squat, push to the side. So squat, push, squat, push. Let's go. Nice and low. Nice and low. Shake it out. We're gonna repeat. So you've got a nice wide stance. You're going into a squat, side, squat, side. Here we go, so squat, push to the side, squat, push. Squat, push right, squat, push left. Stay low, squat, right. You're just doing like a little pulse on each movement. So a little pulse, little pulse. Come on guys, we've got three, two, one. Woo, come down onto the ground with your hand weights if you're using them. We're coming into a plank on our hands and toes and we're doing a tricep extension. Here we go, lift up, kick it back and down. You can do this without hand weights. If you do not want to do the tricep extension with or without hand weights, tap your shoulders, your, your right hand to your left shoulder, left hand to your right shoulder, or whole plank. All right guys, stay here. We're gonna repeat it one more time. You just hold plank if you're not comfortable doing this. Here we go, up onto your toes, tricep extension. Really focus on kicking that arm back. 
You can be doing this without weights just as effectively. Really focus on squeezing that tricep muscle at the top. Keep your feet nice and wide if you need more balance like me. Guys, halfway, second one done. The first exercise of round three is gonna be dynamic squat. Keep resting. This is your lower impact alternative. Okay, step side to side in the squat. Otherwise, here we go. Jump right up in the air, or if you need it a little bit less intense, tap in the middle. Otherwise, step side to side. There is no shame in that. It's still a heart exercise. You are moving your heart, heart rate, elevating your heart rate, I should say. All right, guys, grab your weights if you're using them. Feet a little bit wider than shoulder width. Give me a squat, side raise with the right. Stick it with the right. I'm just holding my hand weights for a little bit extra challenge. You don't need them, you can keep them on the ground. Squat, side raise right. Side raise right. One more. So we're working the side of our booty. Wow, my heart rate's really up there today. Three, two, one. Give me a nice squat, side raise. If you feel like you need to work out harder, optional front raise with the arms. Otherwise, hold the weights for a bit more of a challenge or put them down and use your body weight. One more. Woo! All right. Right, left again. Get your breath back. Here we go, guys. Bring it down. And a nice, deliberate raise. Just flop your leg up in the air. Keep your foot nice and parallel to the ground. I don't want to see it turned up to the ceiling. Nice and parallel. Focus on the squeeze at the top. Squeeze at the top. You're not just raising your leg for the heck of it. That was the last one, shake it out. Squat, raise in the left. Really make sure you focus on that raise. Last one. Let's go, guys. If you are getting tired, go slower. Three ways to build muscle is the weight of the, of the weights that you're lifting or load, volume or time under tension. So just slow it down, shake it out. All right, guys, hold on to one weight. If you're using them, we're doing a wood chopper. Coming to a squat, you bring that weight behind your right knee and over your left shoulder. Let's go. Really twisting it around as if you're picking up something and throwing it over your shoulder. Throwing it over your left shoulder. Give me one more. We're gonna repeat from left to right. In three, two, one. You can be doing this just as well without a weight. Let's go, guys. We've got one more exercise to do in this round. We get a nice 20 second rest and then we are done with one more round after this. <laughs> Come down onto the ground. We can do a tricep push up. Just work out those triceps today. Hands and elbows nice and close to the body. The elbows should be rubbing up against your torso and pushing directly back. Not out, but straight up. Pushing against your torso. Let's go guys, we've only got a few more. Squeeze them out. Give me one more. Push back into child's pose. A little rest. First exercise. It's a dynamic squat. Get your hand weights close by. Remember the three options. So option one, here we go. Go straight in the air. Option two. Option three. No shame in any of these options. Not a competition. You hear 
to work out your own body, not to compete with anyone else. Last one. Pick up these hand weights if you're using them. Put your feet in a small V. We're doing curtsy right leg going back behind you. Optional bicep curl. Here we go. Optional bicep curl, optional knee raise. So you can knee raise or you can tap. You can knee raise or you can tap. Let's go guys. We've only got five seconds to go, come on. Last round of the day, last one. Shake it out. Then we're gonna be doing small V, left going back. Here we go. Left back, either with a tap or with a knee raise. Optional bicep curl. You can leave the weight at your side or you can have no hand weights. Up to you. Five more seconds. Shake it out. Come on guys, we're on the home stretch. Okay, we've got right leg going back. Here we go. With a tap, with a knee up. Let's go guys. Come on, halfway there. Bring it home. Last one on this leg. Let's go. Just think how good you are gonna feel all day long. Okay, shake it out. Remember, just go slower if you need to. Here we go. Left back with a tap or with a knee. Come on guys, I know you got it. It feels so good to work out. You are gonna be so proud of yourself when you finish. Let's go. Three, two, one. All right, put the weights aside. Come down. One more tricep push up. I'm doing it on my knees. Feel free to come up onto your feet. Keep those elbows nice and close to your body. A nice flat back from your tailbone to your head. Find a spot on the floor. Just a little bit in front of you. Focus on that tricep push up. Come on guys. All right. All right guys, two more exercises. We're gonna come on to our hands in a plank. Here we go. I want you to lift opposite hand, opposite foot. If this isn't for you, hold a plank or just lift your legs and then tap your shoulders. So you're doing like a little rotation. Leg, leg, hand, hand. Otherwise, oh, that was the last one. We got one more. Otherwise I wanna see opposite leg, opposite hand. I'm not filming this video again, so <laughs> we're gonna have to be we're gonna have to have a special guest appearance for my dog. Ooh. Opposite leg, opposite hand. Come on guys, otherwise hold plank or just lift up your legs and your hands. Ooh, three, two, one. Ooh, push back into child's pose. Well done guys, great workout. Come down onto our backs. Pull that right leg into your chest. Rotate that ankle. Let's pull your leg up. Give yourself a nice, well-deserved hamstring stretch. Cross that leg over the other. Pull the leg back and push out with your elbow. Breathe into it. Swap it over, left knee into the chest, rotate that ankle. Let's bring it back into a nice hamstring stretch. Damn, it does feel good to work out. Okay, cross the knees over, gently pull it back. All right guys, come up. My favorite, ex it's a favorite stretch, I should say. Cross one leg under you, the other one over. Hug that bent knee. Breathe in and out. Gently look over that shoulder. Don't force any of the stretches. Just gently breathe into them. Change legs. Just 
give yourself a little hug. Breathe in and out. All right, guys, let's give ourselves a little stretch of our quads. Don't lean on your kneecap. Make sure you're rolling up here on the top of your leg. Otherwise, do this standing up if you're not comfortable or your knees hurt. Stand up, hold on to something and give yourself a stretch. All right, guys, come up. Nice side stretch. The other side. Stretch your arms back. Shoulder stretch. The other shoulder. All right, give yourself a little shoulder roll. Well done, guys. You really killed it. Have a great day.